What's up everyone, I'm Arkansas Storm Team Meteorologist Alex Libby and in this video we're talking about the Great American Eclipse, a total solar eclipse that will move right over the natural state, right over Arkansas a year from now, April 8th, 2024, we will see the Great American Eclipse. It'll look just like that picture here on your screen, but before I get to talking about the total solar eclipse a year from today, I do want to touch on another American eclipse that we're going to see, well not here in Arkansas, but the United States will see this year, October 14th, 2023, we will see an annular solar eclipse move from Oregon all the way through Texas. So here in Arkansas, we'll see between a 70 and 80% coverage of the moon blocking the sun. Again, a eclipse is when the moon blocks the sun. It goes in between the earth and the sun and it blocks out its light. So the annular solar eclipse in October, the sun and the moon kind of vary their difference from earth. So on the annular one, the most coverage you'll get is 90%. It'll actually cause a ring around the moon. These are a little bit less rare than a total solar eclipse. Again, that total solar eclipse is expected to move right through Arkansas a year from today, April 8th, 2024. That path of totality stretches from Texarkana up to Mena and goes to the northeast through Heber Springs Mountain Home and even into Jonesboro. Little Rock is included in this path of totality. If you're not under the path of totality, let's say you live in Fayetteville or you're in Pine Bluff or Southeast Arkansas, you won't get 100% coverage and you'll need those special glasses to look at it. Again, the annular one this year, you'll need the sunglasses or the special glasses. They're not sunglasses. They actually block the sun rays. You'll need those. But for the total solar eclipse, you'll be able to take them off for around two or three or four minute period when that sun's completely blocked by the moon you can take them off. So let's name a few towns, let them populate here. In Southwest Arkansas, it's gonna go through Dequeen, Nashville, Murfreesboro, Mena, Arkadelphia, and as it moves through Central Arkansas, Little Rock's included in that, Russellville, Clarksville, Conway, Clinton, also some smaller towns there, Hector, Cave Creek, all the way up to Batson, and Boston, Boston, Arkansas, Pocahontas, Mountain Home, Mountain View, Batesville, and Jonesboro, slightly on that edge. So. The middle of the path of totality, that blue line that you saw earlier, you'll see around four minutes of the sun's rays being completely blocked by the moon. On the edges, Little Rock up towards Jonesboro, Texarkana, the edge of the path of totality only around two minutes. So it might actually be worth going towards the center of the path of totality to get an extra two minutes of complete coverage. Again, this is a huge deal thousands if not millions of people are expected to flock to Arkansas and surrounding states it's going to go through Texas Missouri all the way up through Maine thousands of people are and millions of people are expected to get on that path of totality so you have a year to prepare you have a year to get those special glasses again they're not sunglasses they're a little bit better than that or a lot a bit better than that a year from today we're going to have that really big deal and only thing we can really hope for is the weather the weather, if it's cloudy, it's going to get dark for a few minutes, but you won't be able to see the beautiful sight, the diamond when it comes off the edge, and the complete darkness, of course. So hopefully it is going to be sunny a year from today, like it is today here in Arkansas. All we can do is cross our fingers and hope. I did look at the stats as far as cloudy and clear days go. It looks like we have a 59% chance of a sunny day. That doesn't really mean anything, but I guess it's better than if we were normally really cloudy in April. So a better than half, a better than 50% chance that we'll see a sunny day, April 8th, 2024, mark the calendar. It's gonna be a big day here in Arkansas.